This video is about two macros, one for protecting every worksheet of a workbook in a single go and the other one is for unprotecting all those protected worksheets. Excel sheet protected with a password will restrict the user from modifying or editing the cells. What you see here is a sheet protected using a password. When I right click on these cells, you can see most of the editing options are grayed out. If the user tries to edit a cell or cells in a protected sheet, Excel will display a warning message and protect the sheet using the right password to continue with the editing. I will unprotect the sheet now. In the review tab, unprotect sheet, enter the password and all those editing options are active now. And Excel will let me modify the sheet. We can protect a worksheet using this protect button in review tab. But if you have a large number of sheets to be protected, it's better to go for a macro which will save you considerable amount of time. Here we have 8 worksheets in this workbook. To protect all of them in a single go, go to developer tab, click on visual basic, insert a module. Before creating the macros, I will declare two variables as public so that these variables will be available to both the macros. Public Excel and CAD as worksheet public sonda as string we'll name the macro as protect every worksheet sonda equal input box enter the password to protect the worksheets this statement is for an input box where we can feed the password for protection now we for loop for looping through every worksheet in this workbook for each excellent cat in active workbook dot worksheets excellent cat dot protect password full colon equal sonder. This statement will protect every worksheet with the password given in the input box. Next excellent cat. Back to our worksheet. In the review tab you can see the protect button is active for every worksheet. To protect every worksheet in this workbook using the macro which we created now. Go to developer tab. Click on macros. Select the macro, protect every worksheet. Click on run. And here we have to enter the password. I will use the password XNC. Click OK. And by doing that, we just protected every worksheet in this workbook with a password XNC. We already know what happens when the user tries to edit a protected sheet. Excel displays a warning message. Now the macro to unprotect all these sheets. We'll name this macro as unprotect every worksheet. Declare in memory pass a string. Pass equal input box. Enter the password to unprotect the sheets. An input box where the user can enter the password for unprotecting sheets. If pass equals sonder then this if condition will check whether the user input is the same as the password which was used to protect the sheets. If the condition turned out to be true then a for loop for looping through every worksheet in this workbook. For each excellent cat in this workbook dot worksheets excellent cat dot unprotect password full colon equal sonder. This statement will unprotect the worksheet using the password given in the input box. Else, if the condition turned out to be false, the user should get a message for incorrect password. And if back to our worksheets, we can see here every worksheet is protected. To unprotect every worksheet in this workbook, go to developer tab, click on macros. Select the macro and protect every worksheet. Click on run. We have to specify the password here. This should be the same password which we use to protect all those sheets. The password which we use to protect worksheets is XNC. If I enter a wrong password, say triple A, I will type in the letter A three times and I will get a warning message incorrect password. Once again, click on macros. 
execute the macro and protect every worksheet. This time I will use the correct password XNC. Type in XNC, click OK. And by doing that, we just remove protection from every worksheet in this workbook. Once again, to protect the sheets, execute the first macro, provide a password, let it be Apple. And the sheets are now protected. To unprotect all these sheets, enter the password Apple. And the protection is removed from every worksheet in this workbook. I hope you will find this video useful. For feedback and discussion, please make use of the comment section. And those who are visiting this channel for the first time, subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon so that you won't miss anything. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.